Small business owners are in survival mode and a new survey out this morning shows how they're feeling about the state of the economy. Kate Rogers joins us with more. Hi, Kate. Hi, Wilf. Good morning. The National Federation of Independent Business is out with its monthly read on optimism, showing a decline of 1.8 points in July to 98.8. This is after a big jump up that we saw back in June as states around the country began to reopen. Now, the biggest declines this month were in those who expect the economy to improve. That fell 14 points, as well as those who expect sales to rise and plans to increase inventories. Even with states reopening, the NFIB says sales are often lower due to business restrictions, social distancing requirements, and a still reduced willingness of consumers to go out and mingle with the general population. That's something that CNBC has also seen in our own polling. Surprisingly, the quality of labor is back in the top spot as business owners' single biggest problem that's followed by taxes and government red tape and regulations. Finding good workers apparently has not become easier for respondents, even with so many unemployed. Let's not forget July also brought around the end of enhanced unemployment benefits and small business owners are still waiting to see what comes out of these ongoing negotiations with regard to additional stimulus and new programs like PPP being renewed and potentially lower uh, interest, longer term loans that may be available to them. So all of that likely weighing on optimism as well. Back over to you. Okay, thank you so much uh, for that. Uh, special programming note, by the way, tomorrow the CNBC Small Business Playbook Virtual Summit will gather the most trusted and inspirational voices in business. Cheryl Sandberg, Kevin O'Leary, and many others will provide small business owners, owners the resources to survive today's crisis and a path forward to thrive tomorrow. Visit cnbcevents.com slash small business playbook to learn more and to register.